everyone in the previous video you learned about routing in react using reach router and in this video you will learn about how to fix cannot get url error on page refresh when we are accessing different routes so if you remember in the previous video we had this about and contact us link of course i was styled it just a little bit just to make it look better uh, if you go to about it's going on about uh, if you go to contact us it goes on that route however if i just refresh the page you can see that you get this big error cannot get contact us right now imagine that you know you worked on your project and then you get this error so why do we get this error you know that these routing that this is happening currently is actually uh, on a client side correct so if you're trying to access a route like contact us okay uh, the browser will make a get request to slash contact us which will fail as you have no logic on the server to handle that request because all of your requests are being handled at one single page if you check the application uh, you have your index.html which is where your uh, entire application is being inserted inside of this root right in react so all of the routing is happening here in on this page so if uh, you are trying to access the slash contact us you are actually trying to access the server and on server we don't actually have any logic to handle this contact us so how do we solve this well luckily uh, when using webpack webpack is giving you an option of something called history api fallback okay so it talks about that when using the HTML5 history API, the index or HTML page will likely to have be served in place of 404 responses. Uh, this is disabled by default and you can enable it by setting this to true inside of your webpack.config.js. Okay. So all you have to do is just go to your webpack.config.js and just take this whole thing and just place it somewhere, for example, here just put a comma uh, of course I'll have to restart my server because I made changes to the webpack config.js file okay so now you can see that it says that 404 will fall back to index.html right so all the 404 will now be accessed at index.html now if I again refresh the page sure enough you can see that now it is working so if i go to about refresh the page it works go to contact us refresh the page it works okay there's one more thing that we can add so i have already written a blog on this on coditech.com um, you can you can check that out that's that's my site so let's have a look you can also define a public path in your output like this inside of your output you can define public path to slash okay so which means that what it does is it redirects all your server requests to index.html which will download all the javascript resources and allow the react router to take it from there okay and if you don't do this then of course on server you don't have any logic to hands handle uh, this type of request of slash contact or slash about so this is how it is done Okay, so I hope you did like the video, guys. Uh, and in the next video, we will discuss further. Okay, till then, take care. Bye-bye.